This is your daily market review for Tuesday, October 15, 2024. Let's go. Hey everyone, this is my channel to help investors and traders develop a probability-based mindset to succeed. Also try and keep friends informed of what's going on in the markets and the economy, and also a little real estate content as well. This is Dan Max at EXP Realty, aka the trading agent. This is your daily market review, Tuesday, October 15, 2024. If you've been following the channel, we talked about a lot of things potentially coming up that seemed rather ominous. Now, I know we've talked about traps. We've talked about leaders lagging, lagging leaders, trash floating, market action being confusing considering what's going on. And that's where I've tried to warn people, if you've been bullish, please roll up your stops. If you're bearish and you got to stop out, that's fine. Look to reload at other prices. But my point being is be careful. There's a lot going on. And when I say a lot going on, I mean like we know going forward, we have potential World War III. We know chip sector potentially being banned by China, certain like chips in general being not allowed. We know the U.S. not allowing certain Chinese things, trade wars. We know the election. We know China surrounding Taiwan. We know the, the feds need people to buy bonds. We need all, again, it's, it's hard to know near term what's going to happen. However, to me, the risk versus reward, as the VIX has been holding up, in my opinion, says it's to the downside especially if October becomes scary and things get hairier. So if you need to help, again, new to the channel, check out the Discord room, link description below, and let me know what you need. Don't hesitate. Click on the link below. Let's get the Calendly, Calendly link, and let's chat. Follow, like, subscribe. Posting tons of trades on the Twitter. It's also on YouTube. Again, if you're following YouTube, the Back to Basics Education Series, I don't know why it is not loading. It typically would load along the side. Let's see if we hit the back button. What happens? Maybe we'll come back. Also, my website, tradeagent.com. Turn profits into properties and passive income. That is the goal. Again, tons of videos here. It's on my website and YouTube. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. I would appreciate it a ton. Again, even if you can't, you don't want to donate, there we go, uh, which again, I don't require. I appreciate like, subscribe, sharing. Leave a comment below. I love feedback. Again, how can I make this channel? better that is the goal here strive one percent better every day all right fed watch tool we talked about bonds bottoming recently right now one rate cut is what expected two unless things get worse bitcoin been holding up we talked about watching what happens up here could it be this could this be a trap or are we about to break out because again we hit we're i guess close enough for government work i'd be watching what happens next at sixty-eight thousand. again do i believe in bitcoin I prefer not to really go on record because I don't know. Again, I believe in gold and silver. That's for damn sure. Bitcoin, big choppy range. Watching level to level. Just be careful. Um, to me, MicroStrategy says a lot. Oils, we talked about. Longer term, bullish. Near term, hmm. Ugh. Is Israel really not going to hit Iran's oil supplies? Uh, 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 uh. I don't know. I, I don't believe it. But here's again, we talked about demand destruction, destruction, which means slower economy, slower recovery, whatever you want to call it. Again, man, the industrial production data today, abs or sorry, the Philly Fed, absolutely. New York Fed, not Philly, come on. New York Fed, absolutely just disgusting. Again, I, the economy is slowing fast. It's just a matter of how the market reacts near term. Again, try to do what the market's doing. Natural gas, we talked about, we like it long term, but letting it pull back. Come on back, you here. Dollars. We talked about this didn't make sense. Why is the dollar ripping if everything's good? Typically, it does not do that. Bonds held our trend line to a T. Gapped up today. Posted about it. Is this a professional gap off the lows? Now, there's a lot of gaps in the bonds because of the TLT, right? Keep an eye on it. Any backup now? I'd be watching this 94 air. If we touch it again, could that be a great long trade? The VIX, as we said, if the market's so great and we're breaking out to new highs, why are the VIX not like in the... 14, 15, 16 range. Somebody knows something. Vivix, as we said, that typically bottoms and then leads up. I mean, it's holding up really well. If the market was, in my opinion, in my opinion, like, in my opinion, like, brain freeze, just, I would think it'd be more in the 80s, 70s, 80s, if that was the case with what was going on with the Vivix. Spy. Look at this action. We talked about breaking out. And this is what's hard. Sometimes there's traps, and this is what people are like, oh, you know, blah, 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 blah. Okay. Traps can happen on the weekly, too. You can have days, weeks, breakout, fakeouts. And this is what we talked about. 
All right, congr- and again, so hey, credit to the folks who called the gap fill, because again, I didn't think it was possible, but we talked about this gap yesterday. I was like, this gap didn't really feel very convincing, right? Like, oh, breaking out, fill it should be, look at today's red bar, engulfed it all. Watch the 20 day, IWM holding up pretty damn well. Again, this is, it felt like a little bit of a rotation day, OPEX, but look at this wick. Another one of these wiki, wiki, wiki. Worth a watch. Worth a watch. Dia. Check this out, right? Is it breaking out? I don't know. Keep an eye. This is where this is where it's gonna get funny. Gold. This is the market? More World Three. Breaking out. We'll see. I mean, again, long term, love gold. Love gold. They're gonna print their way out of this, just like China is. Silver. <sighs> Got to get over this twenty nine thirty area. Miners. We like them long term, but I don't like to chase them when the market potentially get butchered. I'd like to have seen the miners leading up. They seem to be following. That's a little bit suspect. Because what I've seen when the VIX explodes and market dumps, these stocks get th- th- they throw the baby out of the bathwater. You've heard that saying before. You've been following the channel. AEM, which had been leading up, is starting to kind of lag. I know it's closer to the highs, but worth a watch. AG at the trend line. AG, are you with me at the trend line? Watching. Newmont. And this should be getting over this 54, 55, 56 area. Keep an eye on it. If you zoom out, it's important. Pass. Head and shoulders top, complex. I don't know. I mean, it's really needs to get over this 23 area. Keep it on it. Be safe. Tech is, in my opinion, has been lagging. It's the, the long term. Do not believe in tech. I'm telling you, when you get this growth tech AI build out and they price in the future like they did with Tesla and every other stock that you've ever seen that had like that Momo pump, if it's technology related, at some point you need inputs. Inputs are the future. That's how who wins the. Think of this as a war. You want to bet on the country and the soldiers, or you want to bet on the guys making bullets and ammunition. That's what I want to bet in, and that's why I think commodities long term. Taiwan Semi looks like a scary little double top there. Keep an eye on it. Micron, remember, it is option expiration. We talked about this lagging, hitting the 100 day, bleh, backing off. AMD, everybody and their mom was going, oh, it's going to fill the gap. Okay, didn't. Yikes. Look at this, broke gap down. Ugh. NVIDIA. Everybody thinks it's going to the moon. Put call ratios at point something, almost zero. <laughs> All in calls. We, <laughs> Goldman upgrades. One more day. Bleh. Again, it's not really technically broken, but I'd be watching these candles because they look fugly as fudge. SMCI hitting the 50 day seems to be chop, chop, fizz, fizz, what a relief it is. Intellectual property. Talked about this getting delisted. People go, oh, I don't know, dude. Okay, I want to keep an eye on it. SMH, look at this. <laughs> if you bought the Soxus, you made like 15% real quick. Look at this big red bar. Red, red bar. Dun, 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 dun. Big volume. Engulfs. Eats everything up. <laughs> you got to be scared at the top. That's not what is normal. Holding the whole 120 day. I'm telling you, those tariffs or whatever... China's not going to want our chips. We're not going to sell chips to them. I'm telling you, there's something coming. Adobe. Chopping around after a big gap down. Look at Apple today. It looks like it's going to break out. I said, watch it. Put that on your watch list. Boink. Doji. After this gap up. Get the picture. Be careful. Amazon. Amazonian. Again, we are going to earnings, so there's going to be some volatility. Again, Bezos has to keep selling. We'll see what happens. Amazon is not one I would probably be looking at long-term. My uh, good old Facebook meta. Back test the trend line. Look at that sucker. Loves hugging it. I just watched the 20 day. I mean, I know Zuck is kissing the DT ring. CRM looks like it was going to break out. We'll see. I mean, big resistance zone here. Keep an eye on it. Guggenheim. Guggenheim. This one seems to be stuck. I mean, I'm just going to widen the zone out. I'd watch the 100 day. I mean, going into earnings tech, again, that's where I think shorting tech through ETFs of the indexes or certain subtors might be easier than certain names. Less risky. Microsoft looks like nothing. NASDAQ popped today like, ooh. Again, I think the NASDAQ as a index is the easy short. When I say easy short, meaning like, again, no one's going to be listing on the NASDAQ. They're just, they don't do tech. Hmm? MicroStrategy. Again, we talked about MicroStrategy leading. 
Look at yesterday's candle. Hits all these freaking trend lines. Hits all this stuff. Long term. <laughs> Big pullback. Is, do you really think we're going to lead or lag Bitcoin? Again, I, MicroStrategy usually leads. Again, let me, sorry, go back. That's a big fucking move. Excuse my language. We talked about this. Hitting the 200-day. You go from 112 up to 225. Take some profits or the market's going to take them for you. Manage your positions. Maybe buy calls. <laughs> buy puts. Maybe, uh, well, no, I'd probably sell out-of-the-money calls to buy out-of-the-money puts. And if it goes down, great. And you got the stock. You're hedged. And you just collect that premium on the calls. So the puts should be free. There's a lot of strategies. Netflix earnings well, Thursday. Be careful. Roblox getting involved in some pedo stuff. Ooh, looked like it was going to break out. <clears throat> Pan W. I don't know what else to say. I mean, again, I like, I like Roblox because I think it is a good stock company potentially, but not with the news it had. Let it, let it digest. Pan W, again, we like cybersecurity. If you're going to go into the tech subsectors, long term, yes. Near term, no. That just again, I want I don't want to buy the highs. I try to explain that to people. I just don't. Oh, got to sneeze. <coughs> Whoa! All right, just be careful. All right, Tesla. Keep an eye on this. We've talked about this, you know, being a. Speaking of like, Nvidia, like just ooh, trying to break out. All in. Everyone's all in. Electric vehicles. Now we're just in this big choppy base zone. I mean, I don't know what to tell you. I mean, I'd, I'd sell highs, buy dips. I'd, I mean, it looks like it's a big consolidation pattern. Insight, that's all I can really say. Just be careful. We like this company. where They will get bought out probably with their pipeline. I mean, their public data is looking good. Just keep an eye on it. I'd like to see this in the 50s. Plantar, fasciitis, palantir, whatever the hell you say. I can always like messing things up sometimes. Talked about there's been a big move. Every time it goes big, it starts to pull back and sideways. I'm not surprised. We talked about if you had... Calls, you probably want to sell them, hedge some, keep an eye on it. McDonald's, keep an eye on this candle today. I am not a fan of this. So you consolidate, consolidate, consolidate. You break out, you gap up. If the market starts pulling back, that could turn into a red bar real quick. Just keep that in mind. DKNG, we talked about this being trash. Trash floats, and then it's giving it up. Chop, chop. Airbnb. Airbnb. Here's another one. Trash floats last. Watch the 100 day. Costco. This has been holding up incredibly well. Been the boss. Keep an eye on it. Starbucks. All right. Chop, chop. Chop, 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 chop. FedEx. Again, we talked about this. After the CEO appointment, it gaps up. It's going nowhere until they execute. You're probably going to need another earnings call, right? Does that make sense? FedEx. Gaps down, things you don't see if the economy strong. Chopping around 20, 100 day, 200 day, sorry. Caterpillar, 20 day. Watching this today in between doing some work. I was like, hmm. Big consolidation pattern. Hmm. Hmm. Keep an eye on it. DE, right? Hits the range highs. Uh -oh. Staying under the 20 day. Uh -oh. New core. Again, we like commodities, we like industrials long term. <laughs> Someone's got to mine up all this crap. It's going to be Caterpillar. Um, be careful, but in the near term, 100 day. Like we like X. I like it in the 20s, even the teens. Ballet, global growth name for China, right? They buy a ton of commodities from Brazil. Not looking so hot. Arrow, we like junior copper, but look at this stuff. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, this, ugh, it's hard. It's hard for a player. But this is where we want to let it do this. Make sense? CCJ again, we like. Uranium. You like Uranus. It just, it's going to be struggle here from a straight line. When you go from 36 to 52, it probably consolidates. We like ag long term, but is it going to pull back? Yeah, I hope so. As I've said, I think Mosaic, CF, NTR, like they're all good long term. Just let them chop around. Like just let them get throttled, throttle bust. AA, we like aluminum, right? Zoom out. You've got to love aluminum. That's going into everything. It's heat resistance, cheap, it's abundant. Like it. it's kind of like copper. You got who doesn't like copper? Excellent. The banks and <laughs> we've talked about the banks playing the game, going into earnings. All right, held up. Is this a breakout or a fake out? 
You tell me when we look at some of these names, right? Like, I don't want to, again, it's not my opinion. I, I was wrong. Happens. Been wrong, wrong before. I've said, I don't trust it. Okay. JP Mo. Why would you buy their stock? They don't even want to buy back their own stock. They had a double top. Morgan Stanley, like popped really well this morning. Felt like it was doing well with, uh, they have earnings tomorrow morning with Goldman. Coming into a trend line. I mean, put this on your radar. Do which trend line is it, if I remember correctly? Oh, it's an old one. Oldie. Old but goody. Old but good one. Nice move up. That big red bar at the high is a little scary. Bank of America. You wonder how many shares Buffett sold today on the gap up? Things that you don't see if they're strong. Red alert. Goldman Sachs, right? Runs up to four, 540. Ugh. I mean, you just squeezed all the bears' balls, and you got bulls to chaw, chaw all in. Ooh, KRE. Ooh, look at the wick. <laughs> Let's get everybody in the pool, and then pull the rug on him. Or pour gasoline and light it on fire. Maybe the pool's made of gasoline. Ooh, even worse. It's, it's not looking good. XBI. Been chopping around. It's been a risk on, risk off name. Some Jets. I know the people who are betting against the Jets, and we're not talking about... I mean, I guess they got... Uh, what's his name? Devontae Adams. But Jay Solstice and some folks. I mean, again, I, I like to talk. I, I will give credit. I love when people post in the Discord room. I appreciate it. Post their ideas and thoughts. Maths, massive shout out. Again, you're not betting against Aaron and Rodgers. You're talking about the Jets here. Airplanes. Look at this. Ooh. Ooh. That's a good trade. It looks to set up XHB again. A housing. Ooh. <laughs> Told you guys. I mean, I'm on the front line. See it every day. Ooh. <laughs> Inventories exploding. Price decreases everywhere. Banks a little sketched out. Ugh, what's wrong with that? <laughs> Solar. All right, here we go. Another risk off name. Ugh, hits a 200 day. Doink. Fail. At Sedge, I said this is going to 15. I think it's, I mean, remember, if you shorted in 300s, high five to you. Here's to you. Short seller of Sedge at 315. 15 is going to be your non magic number. Uh, ENPH. Uh oh. <laughs> don't know what to say other than, uh-oh, first solar, same thing, uh-oh, we talked about the blow-off trap, uh-oh, HYG, you've got to be high as a kite to be buying corporate debt, I don't know what else to say about that, USO, Israel's not going to take out oil supplies, uh, okay, oil in general weakening, okay, sure, we'll see how much downside, UNG, right, Ten cuidado, I hate this freaking product, KOLD, love to see it hit the 80s, 90s, remember if you shorted up here and covered down here, high five to you, XOP said, be careful. Trend line, 100 day, 200 day. T resistance. Bow. Again, longer term, like this stuff. But guess what happens? Got to, again, it still baby out with bath water. Bolero, choppy, choppy. Break the lows, MPC. Break the lows, watch out. You see the lows, y'all. Exxon Mobil, fake breakout, all time highs coming back. Ugh, you don't want to see that. Occidental, we talked about selling calls in the money. Again, long term, probably disappear. You're going to see a higher price. And if it's not taken out with Buffett, think of Bank of America. He's buying more shares. Might have guessed. And Buffett, I'm talking about Warren Buffett. Warren Buffett. You know Warren Buffett? Yeah. Warren B. Sorry, drinking an energy drink before this. It's been a long day. Excuse me. Yeah, I'm just, I don't know. I, I, again, if, if I owned the stock, loved it, dividends, I'd be selling calls. EQT, love it long term. Let it play out. Flex LNG, last but not least. Flex LNG. Big consolidation patterns. All right. Let me know if you have any questions. Always here to help. Don't hesitate to reach out. Use the Calendly link. If you need help buying, selling, or investing in real estate and you're not reaching out, holy shit. You're going to want my insights. You're going to want some insights. Again, please, for the love of God, do not use just your local neighbor, your friend, agent. Let me help you find your agent. You'll get two for the price of one. You'll get my ability to negotiate again negotiation that is where the money's made in my opinion that's what i love the most about negotiating real estate using the leverage of psychology things that i am passionate about people who know me know the news knows love that stuff that's my favorite part but also strategy how are you going to sell your house what kind of strategy are you going to use a uh, auction style or are you just going to list it high and see what the freak happens I'm telling you there's strategies out there that are working if you're not working with the best agents what are you doing it's your biggest asset don't go and work with the freaking discount broker Work with the best. You don't you got law, you got health issues, and you need help. Don't sacrifice. You deserve the best. Talk to you guys and guys later.
Hey, thanks for watching. If you have any questions, stop by the Discord room. A link is in the description below. Also, if you'd like to help support more free content, the PayPal link is in the description as well. I appreciate your continued support of the channel.